On May 21, 2024, officers in Ohio responded to a local residence after a report of an active family dispute. The call involved 30-year-old Chelsea Reimer, who had been drinking before starting a dispute at home. The situation escalated as Chelsea thrashed her mother's bedroom and smashed the TV. Chelsea then assaulted another woman in the home, prompting the family to call deputies for help. Here's what the deputies do next. He's nuts! She punched me in my face because I was trying to... She kept her out of the door. I was just blocking her. Where's she at? I think I'm bleeding somewhere. I'll check here, remember. I mean, they've had to hold her down. She tore my whole room up, broke my TV. I'm going to push it work again. You know, your favorite house. What's up? Here's someone on my phone. Hey, Charlie. What's going on? Uh, huh? Uh, Something's going on. What? I don't know. Tear my room up, break my TV, destroy it. Leave it shattered. Leave it shattered. Whole room turned off. My kids are upstairs. Scared to death. Three year old in the room. What's, what's up? She's nothing. Huh? Bullshit. Bullshit. So come at me, yellow your dad. Bullshit. 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 Bullshit
Now you got an assault charge. Plus the resisting, plus the EV. What else do you want? Get up. What's her name? Chelsea, right? Chelsea. I can't breathe. Chelsea, I breathe can't. for me, okay? We're gonna get you in the I car, alright? <laughs> well, you're gonna put me in my dolphin little house, you <laughs> Oh, gee, thank you. You're welcome. I'll go to Hannah. Hi. I was, heard you on the radio, and I'm like, Oh, there he is. <laughs> <sighs> the suspect was charged with two counts of domestic violence and resisting arrest. In court, the prosecutor dismissed one count of domestic violence. The suspect pleaded guilty to both the charges of domestic violence and resisting arrest. At this time, the suspect's next hearing has yet to take place. On January 14th, 2024, officers in Ohio responded to a call from an intoxicated female reporting a dispute over her attempting to enter a residence. The caller, identified as 18-year-old Jessica, refused to cooperate with dispatch as officers made their way to the scene. Upon arriving, officers knocked on the door multiple times, trying to make contact with Jessica or the homeowner. As the officers reached out to dispatch to contact someone inside the home, they spotted Jessica waving at them through a side window. Here's what the officers do next. So can you please you? answer? That's can crazy you because I'm going to bed. Can you please Good go night. get them? No. Can you please We're get whoever the adult is at this house? 82. I said there was a dispute between sisters. She's got a black eye too. It's really weird. That that was weird. Yeah, she won't. Sorry, it looks like we have multiple previews with the Tara and Jessica. Their father lives at that residence and they're teenagers. That's clear. Do you have the father's phone number by chance? I tried to put my foot in the dang door and it didn't. It, for some reason it shot I guess I didn't I don't know. So she's just over there staring at us right now. Yeah, she's being very uh bizarre. I thought I heard someone else like come out, so maybe they'll. Hi, can we get an adult here, please? Y'all need to go home. No, because we need. I not until we talk to an adult. Okay, I'm gonna give. So can you please go get them goodbye. so I can leave? Goodbye. Can you please go get them so goodbye. I can leave? Can go get them. Can you goodbye? Step inside. Don't I need <laughs> Can you get whoever is the adult that's here so I can talk to them please? Because hey, we're having hey, issues. No, no, no. Can we please? Here, bro. I'm the stop. I need you to step board. back. Stop. Hey, don't grab me. Stop. What the f came here stop. for? What the f did you come here for? Step back. Hey. Step back. What the f did you come here for? Don't touch me. Step back. Don't touch me! Don't grab me! Don't Step touch back. me! Don't touch me! Step Step back. Back. Don't touch me! Oh. So this outside. Oh, please, 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 come back. Come back. Stop! Stop. Stop. I do! Stop. 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 Whole new issue! <laughs> what did I do though? Whoa. I will explain it to you. Y'all are not explaining down. shit! You I'm, have calm I'm down. not calm because y'all ain't tell, telling me what the f I did! I to calm down. Now. Okay, you. but I did! I did what the f I told y'all! Y'all told me it was to do when I calm okay. down. Uh, slide it. Let go of me, slide bro. Slide it. I'm not touching I'm you right sliding. now. No. Okay. Okay, so we had a phone call here of someone highly intoxicated that was running around trying to break into the house. That's why we're here. I knocked on the door. She was over at the window making weird hand signs. We asked to come to the door just so we could talk to you guys to figure out what's going on because she's obviously she was pounding on the door. So that's who uh, she's our, she's obviously who called. So we didn't know what was going on. I just want to talk to you because I know you're the adult of the house here to make sure no one was actually breaking in. She refused to let us in. We tried to get dispatch to contact you again. The second we I tried guess, to come in, yeah, I, the second we just tried to make contact with you again, she's grabbing us, trying to fight us. So that's why she's in custody right now, for fight, trying to fight the cops. That's it. So she's gonna go in for disorderly conduct, just for 
trying to grab us, fight us, as I'm trying to talk to you, she's trying to grab us, punch us. We can't have that. So, all I needed was contact with you, and she could have gone right back to bed. She decided to make this a whole thing. Like I said, I know I've been out here before for them fighting. That's all I wanted to know. So, yeah. she could have just come and got you. We could have been this whole thing. Could have been gone. That so. needs to learn a lesson. So. Absolutely. But you said that she was outside banging and knocking. Uh, I woke up with her banging on the back door. That's she 18? Yes. Okay. And so if she goes outside banging on the back door, that's all I need to know. She's our caller. She, I can smell the alcohol on her. So she's intoxicated. She's going to go in for disorderly conduct. So, yeah, like I said, she could have been avoided this whole thing just by coming and getting you. That's all I wanted. So. Okay. All right. Thank you. Um, sorry. No, you're all good. Like I said, it all could have been avoided if she would have just listened. But thank you. The suspect was charged with disorderly conduct and resisting arrest. In court, the prosecutor dismissed the charge of resisting arrest. The suspect pleaded guilty to the charge of disorderly conduct. The court sentenced her to 30 days in jail with 27 days suspended and placed her on two years of community control. Additionally, she was ordered to attend anger management classes and pay $291 in fines and court costs.